So, you wanna steal color grades from some of the most popular movies and TV shows out there and use it on your footage? Well, then you're in the right place because in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to quickly steal any color grade from your favorite TV shows or movies and put them in your video. All that stuff coming up. But first, if you're new here, my name is Billy Ripka and I make weekly DaVinci Resolve tutorials about different effects, transitions, and workflows that'll help you become a better editor. So if you wanna level up your editing skills, click the subscribe button and the bell notification to stay up to date on the newest videos put out. But let's get into this. So now that we're in DaVinci Resolve, the first thing that I'm gonna show you guys is how to steal a color grade from a movie clip and apply it to another clip that I found online that looks a lot like the original movie. So they're like almost the same kind of setup. Then after that, the second thing I'm gonna show you is how to steal a color grade from one clip and apply it to another clip that looks completely different. So definitely stick around for that because that's super important. So anyway, enough talking. I'm just gonna start with this first one and get into it. So as you can see here on my timeline, you can see that I have a few clips clips and then a picture from the movie The Martian. I love the color grade in this movie. I actually just recently saw it. It was like really good. So to do this, you're just going to jump into the color tab right here and you're going to open up your clips section right here. Now this is going to show you all the clips that are within your timeline. So you can see that I have the video clips here and you can play through that. I always start by creating another serial node. So I hit Alt S on this node right here, and it creates another serial node. Then I select the clip that I want to receive the color grade and hold control and click on the image or the video file, whatever, that you want to pull the color grade from. So in this sense, I want to pull the color grade from this clip right here, the Martian, and put it onto this desert clip. So this clip selected, right click on the clip that you want to pull the color grade from, and go to shot match to this clip. And now you see that Resolve actually pulls the color grade and does its best job to match the two clips together. But let's say that the color grade is way too aggressive for you and you want it to be toned down a little. You can go to the key section right here, I already have it opened, and under key output, go to your gain and you can actually bring down the strength of that color grade. So you can bring it down to like half if you want, or all the way down and it's just gonna be that normal clip again. So if you wanna take it one step further and actually change the colors around or like really tweak it, you can still use your color wheels right here and do it that way. So if you really wanna add some emphasis on the red slash orange, you can bring it up. If your exposure isn't enough, you can really bring the exposure up. Or if you want you know, more contrast, you can bring your gamut down. So you can see that this works with clips that are relatively similar in the way that they were shot. But if you're trying to match two clips that have completely different colors, sometimes it won't work, but other times it will. So for example, in my Lumafade video, I wanted to match this shot right here with this clip because I wanted the same colors from this image right here onto this waterfall clip. So I highlighted it right here, held control. I went to shot match to this clip and it looked like crap. So obviously I was like, that will not work. So I just switched it around and actually matched this shot right here with this one. So once again, I added a serial node right here. I selected the clip that I wanted to receive the color grade. So that's this one right here. And then holding control, I clicked on the clip that I wanted to take the color grade from and then right click and go to shot match to this clip. And you can see that it actually takes the color grade really well. And once again, if I wanna adjust the strength of it, I can go to key output and bring down the gain. But quite honestly, I was totally okay with it. So as you guys can see, this method can bring you fast and good looking results. So there you have it. Now you know how to steal color grades from your favorite movies and TV shows and put them in your videos. If you thought this video was helpful, give it a like, and also share with your friends so that they know how to do this also. If you like me, hit the subscribe button, and if you really like me, hit that bell notification. You guys have no idea how much that actually helps. Also, if you wanna see these videos early, check my Patreon out because I do a lot of things like release videos early, post blooper videos, post update videos, and do actually a bunch of polls on there because there's a whole list of things that goes on over there that does not happen on YouTube. So I have a question for you guys. What is your favorite color grade? Like what movie or TV show did it so right for you guys that you just are like blown away? For me, it's like The Martian. I love the colors in that movie. So let me know what your favorite color grade is in the comments below. As usual, the video on the top is a video all about the awesome 3D pop-out effect in DaVinci Resolve. And the video on the bottom is a video that YouTube thinks that you would like. But until the next one, peace.